All right, going to show you proof from the Word of God that the scriptures existed before Satan started his apostate and heretical perversion of Christianity known as the Roman Catholic Church. Roman Catholicism is nothing but a heathen, Greco Roman heathen perversion of Bible believing Christianity. And the Catholic Church, Roman Catholics of the claim, well, the Catholic Church gave you the Bible. Uh, no, we're going to see that the Holy Scriptures existed hundreds of years before Satan started his Mystery Babylon Greco Roman Heathen Roman Catholic cult. So let's go to the Scriptures. First, turn to Romans chapter 3, beginning at verse 1 down to verse 2. What advantage then hath the Jew? Or what profit is there of circumcision? Much very much every way, chiefly, because that unto them were committed the oracles of God. What are the oracles of God? The scriptures. Who is it committed to? The Jews. According to Romans three verse one to two. The scriptures were committed before the Roman Catholic cult ever came into existence. Turn to Acts chapter seven verse thirty eight. This is he that was in the church in the wilderness with the angel which spake to him in the Mount Sinai, Sinai and with our fathers who received who received the lively oracles uh, to give unto us. Who received the lively oracles? The Jews. The church in the wilderness referring to Israel. Um, they received the lively oracles. The oracles of God according to Acts 7.38. wasn't the Roman Catholic Church that received the oracles of God. 1 Peter 4.11 If any man speak, let him speak as the oracles of God. If any man minister, let him do it as of the ability which God giveth, that God in all things may be glorified through Jesus Christ, to whom be praise and dominion forever and ever. Amen. Notice how it says, if any man speak, it doesn't say, if any man speak, let him speak as the traditions of the church, or the papal bulls, or the church councils, or the church fathers. No, let him speak as the oracles of God, the scriptures. That's the standard, not the church traditions. Hebrews chapter 5 verse 12. For when, for the time, ye ought to be teachers, ye, ye have need that one teach you again, which be the first principles of the oracles of God, and are become such as, ye, such as have need of milk, and not of strong meat. Oracles of God, not Catholic traditions of men. The oracles of God. The scriptures. John chapter 5 verse 39. Search the scriptures, for in them you think you have eternal life, and they are they which testify of me. Search the scriptures. Don't search Catholic traditions of men. Don't search the writings of church fathers. Search the scriptures. That's the standard. And the scriptures existed before the Catholic Church. Because if the Catholic Church gave us the Bible, why is he saying search the scriptures? And it's funny because if the Catholic Church did, did give us the Bible, how come they would ban people from reading the Bible and only the priests can read the Bible and that kind of stuff? Even though, jo even though Joshua chapter 1 verse 8 clearly talks about meditating on God's word and studying God's word. But no, only the priests can read the Bible. You can't read the Bible on your own, you, you know, you simple laity. It's Nicolaitanism. It's popery. That's all it is. The scriptures existed before Catholicism. Search the scriptures, not search the church and then they'll give you the scriptures later on. Acts chapter 17 verse 11. These were no these were more noble than those in Thessalonica in that they received the word with all readiness of mind and searched the scriptures daily whether these things were so. They searched the scriptures. Why? Because the scriptures were around back then before the Catholic Church came into existence. And those, that's the last verse I was going to have you turn to, but 
the Word of God is, is the standard, and the Word of God existed before the Catholic Church. And I might do a whole separate video on how the Word of God, not traditions of men, the Catholic Church traditions, are the standard. But these, because these verses I showed you are really good scriptures showing that the Word of God is our standard. That's where we should be getting our doctrine from. But it just shows also that they had the oracles of God back in the early church before Satan started his Roman Catholic cult. So don't, don't be deceived when Catholics say, oh, we gave you the Bible. No, they didn't. Romans 3, verse 1 to 2. Uh, because unto them, the Jews, were committed to the oracles of God. Paraphrasing, of course. The scriptures were around before the Catholic Church. They did, the Catholic Church did not give us God's word. The Catholic Church is a, is a satanic cult that was formed out of the councils of Satan because the persecution of, of Roman Christians was not working because they kept laying down their lives for the gospel. So Satan had to create a counterfeit Christianity to counteract the true biblical Christians, the scriptural Christians who were following the faith once delivered unto the saints in accordance to Jude 1 3. Satan had to counterfeit that, which was the Roman Catholic Church. That was his counterfeit Christianity to the biblical New Testament Christians. So don't be deceived by Roman Catholicism. May the grace of our Lord Jesus Christ be with all the brethren. Goodbye.